Sabi. <laughs> My brother! <laughs> this is an amazing line, I tell you, but I swear to God. You know what? <laughs> this place makes me feel really, really, really good. I know. You know, right? <laughs> yeah. You know what? I've been meaning to tell you this. Marriage is a wonderful thing. Marriage makes you happy from morning to night, from dusk to dawn. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at my wife. This lady right here is a blessing to me. Oh, she is. She is. She is. God gave me this woman for free. He said, go, take, enjoy. <laughs> you know? She was sent to me as an angel from heaven to earth. <laughs> I tell you, my baby, I love you. I love you from, from morning to night, from, from dark to dawn. And get ready, I'm going to see one. You know, right? Easy, Tiger. Easy, man. No, 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 no. Don't tell me to take it easy, okay? Trust me, I'm not drunk. I'm telling you the truth from my heart. Marriage is an awesome thing. You should get married very soon. Oh, oh okay. I, I, I'm going to have to stop you there because <laughs> I see where this is going. Huh? Um, Amara, yes. Can I talk to you? Yes. Women and gossip. Why don't you guys go ahead and talk about what you want to say here? Come on, babe. Okay, it's all right. No, don't worry. I'll just go. Take your time. You understand. Don't worry. Go and have fun gossip. <laughs> <laughs> My brother! Cheers, man. Cheers to good life. We should actually get another bottle. Yeah. For the roll. Of course. You know? Look, don't think I'm drunk. <laughs> you know what? I'm not drunk, you know. I think we should get something stronger. Stronger, right? Something with like vodka. Like, yeah, I'll like that. Bye, Mark! <sighs> My husband. What is it? Who be or invaded my dream? What? What, what? what did he say? If you see the slap he gave me, just because I told him to leave you alone. You're being serious. I'm serious. He also threatened to deal with your husband if you do not permit him to. Yeah. What kind of problem is this? What, what, what is this? How can I be married to two men? One is human, the other one is spirit. What am I going to do? Fina, should I tell my husband? Hey, uh, don't you dare. See, don't worry, just calm down. I, I, I think of something. I, I know there's a solution to this problem. Yeah? Uh, see, anything you do now, my trigger is anger. Hey, yes, but um, what, 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 see, I know that Obi will not hurt me or you, you know he loves us so much, he will not hurt us, Fina, 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 he's a ghost, we live in different worlds, you know, I don't, I you see, we have to go back there, but I promise you, I will look for a solution to this problem, because me, I don't want anything to happen to your marriage, don't be scared, don't be scared, I'm here, I'm here, we're in this together, okay, okay, Let's go back before they start looking for us. Yeah. Oh, oh, here they are. Oh, wow. I hope everything is fine, baby. Yeah. Is everything cool? Yes. Yeah, we'll actually want to order vodka. You guys don't mind, right? Let's let's have another bottle. Yeah, let's have another bottle. For the Something road. strong, you know, for One the road. For the road. No. For the road. You know, just to put us in the spirit. You know? The spirit. Yeah, the spirit. Baby, so we on. can. Go home soon. Which spirit? The spirit in which of them? That's the spirit who just ordered. Oh, the vodka. Bama! Where's the Bama here? The Bama! Life is just a stage. Where yeah, everybody comes and perform After which they go back to their destination Don't allow your pastor in your life Because
Light and darkness has nothing in common. Just as life and death. When you are with a mother, what a make My dear, move on with your life. Life is just a stage. Where everybody comes and perform. After which, they go back to their destination. Don't allow your pastor in your life. Because light and darkness has nothing in common. Just as life and death. When you are a mother, what a make My dear, move on with your life. In this world, we live alone. Uh, Malupe, we uh, die alone. Everything else oh, is yeah. just illusion. Uh, My dear, move on with your life. Oh, yeah. Yes, Obi. Free your heart. Uh, Always play with oh, yes. Me. I missed you. Hold me, hold me. Hold me, Obi. Oh, I missed you. Oh, Jesus. Who is Obim? Why are you calling some other person's name while in bed with me? I don't know what is happening. What is happening? I should be asking you another question. What is going on? What's happening? Obim. I'm sorry. I don't know. This is, this is not happening to me. What are you doing with the sanitary towel? Baby. I don't know. It. It's not happening to me. What is going on? Nothing in common. Just as life and death. When you're with a mother, what a make My dear, move on with your life. That was how I lost him. We loved each other so much. And we made lots of promises to each other. This. This is unbelievable. Good morning, my darling husband. Good morning, my love. Mm. Ah. How did you sleep? Well, I slept very well. And how did you sleep? Mine was sweet with my head on your shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> Are you okay? Yeah. Okay. Hey? Yes, my love. I've been meaning to ask you a question. Of course. What is it? Well, right after we finished making love, I noticed you always use um, a sanitary towel immediately just before you go to bed oh uh, that uh, that's uh, that, that's that's uh, nothing really serious i mean you know how my flu can be sometimes it comes unexpected yeah Don't you think you should see the doctor about it? 
No. <laughs> it's it's nothing. It's it's just a woman thing. I'm okay, trust me. Are you sure? Hundred percent. I'm fine. If you say so. Yes. I love you, okay? I love you. I love you. I'll be upstairs, yeah? Alrighty. That was close. <sighs> he threatens to crumble you. And he also sent threats to Fina, his twin sister here. I was scared. So I let him in. What? I intentionally did it. Mara, I told you to hold on that I was looking for a solution. It's going to hurt my husband. This is all sounding like a scene from a movie. You see, it's going to hurt me. How? Look, Frank. Obira was my twin brother. When he was alive, they both shared a bond. But we need to act fast. Else he will strike. Why am I hearing this for the first time? I am sorry, but, but this is all your fault. You left me alone. And I was enjoying this company, but not anymore. I, I, I don't want this anymore. I just want my home. So what are we going to do? What do we do now? Are you trying to say that Ubiora comes to your to your house? No, Papa. He comes to my dream. And he tries to force himself inside of you. Yes. When I refuse, he vowed to, to destroy my home. No, I, I don't think the brother would, <laughs> would do a thing like that. Yes, he is doing something like that. And that's why we came here for a solution. We cannot continue like this. This whole thing is looking very spooky. Eh? There's no peace in our home anymore. My son, it's okay. Relax your mind. Oh, mom, relax your mind. Everything will be all right. Oh, mom. Like my wife rightly said, I want you to relax your mind. There is a solution. I will take you somewhere. And after that, that spirit will stop to disturb you and your wife. I hope so. I hope so. I, I am ready. Anywhere you want us to go, I am ready.
Organique 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 It is done. He will no longer bother your home. Thank you so much. We are very grateful. We are indeed grateful. Wise one. I hope this is the last time we would hear from him. I don't want any further torments on my wife. No more. She is a free woman. I told you he will be tied up for life. And he will not come disturb your wife. I hope so. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, Uncle. Hey! <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Yes. I'm alright, Chuku. Mama, please don't forget what I told you. Call me as soon as you get to the city. Thank so that I'll be, I'll be sure you people arrive safely. Oh. Oh. I will, Mama. And do take care of Papa for me. Hmm? Did you hear that? <laughs> what, take care of what else am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> Are you two take care of your husband? Take oh, care of my in law for me, please. No problem. I will. She, will. she always does. <laughs> Mama, let us run. Okay. There's no time. Right. Thank you very much, Mama. Oh. All right. So, bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. 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 Nothing in common, just as life and death. When you're alone, when I'm 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 alone, I would never imagine that it would happen to us. You know, the few times that I heard about something like this, I was told that it could only happen to a widow or a widower. I would never imagine that it would happen to married couples who are madly in love with themselves. Babe, we've gotten past it. I don't want to talk about it anymore. Please. I'm sorry. Okay. I love you very much, okay? Yes. I spoke to a Catholic priest. Yes, I explained everything to him and I also booked an appointment. Trust me, everything will be alright. Yes, yes, I believe. Okay. So, where are you? Mm -hmm, at home, okay. No way, Anna. I'll try and see you later. <laughs> I miss you, girl. Alright. Bye. What's the meaning of this? What are you doing? Is this how you're supposed to dress to the office? Uh, is there anything wrong with my dress? No, 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 no there's, there's absolutely nothing wrong with your dressing. Just go naked. Huh? Or you can wear lingerie to the office. 
That's what you want, right? I'm sorry, sir. You want to turn this place to a pop house? I'm sorry, sir. Sorry for yourself, Elizabeth. Go and wear something decent right away. I don't care if you have to go home, but go and change. Um, I'm sorry, sir. Sir, the meeting. What meeting? You want to appear before my client like this, looking this way? That's what you want to do? Sorry, go sir. and wear something Hi. decent. Hi, sir. <laughs> 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 Sit here. Feel like a boss. <laughs> of course. This is all yours. You look fabulous, my darling. Look at you. Where do you go to yeah. look at this heart? I'm coming to see my husband. <laughs> That's very good. Yes, sir. I have something for you. Really? What is it? Is everything okay with me? Just a minute. How's your face Light of my Lord. I love you, you are baby. the best thing that happened to me. Oh, my I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you. Oh! Honestly, I am not happy right now. I am not happy. Can you imagine that I have always wanted my boss to look on my side, but it's not working. Yes, it's not. And you can imagine, he threatened to sack me if I don't pull off what I'm wearing. He said he's too exposed. I don't know what's wrong with that man. He can't even look at me. He can't, nothing, nothing is happening. Yes. <laughs> no be small thing, no. I am even going back to the office. That's the worst part. I am going back to the office. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll call you when I get home. I'm not going home right now. Yeah. All right, bye. <laughs> Please, how much is this one? See, huh? yes. I was thinking it's going to be a girl with name. It's a her. boy. No, it's it's a girl. It's a boy. Are you the one pregnant? I feel this baby's kick is definitely a boy. Oh, really? Yes. So you, there's there's a kind of kick for boys. Yes. Yeah? Yes, it's a boy kick. Okay. Mm -hmm. And you can tell it's a boy. Yes. 
I want. I want a boy, it's going to be a boy, period. <laughs> you are so beautiful, my love. You? Most beautiful woman on earth. I love you so much. And I love you too. <laughs> so, sweetheart, let me help you slice something. Let me help you with the hands, huh? I know you. You want to help me? <laughs> Your car, I think. <laughs> All right, fine. Good help me. But don't finish it. No problem. Don't go tonight. I've been looking at the bathroom. This afternoon, this afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> you remember when you were looking for me everywhere? Yes. Even in the farm? Uh -huh. Every building where I go, you follow me. Uh -huh. Now you want me to follow you. No right you are no cargo now. <laughs> <laughs> See, I, I'm still hot too. Well, I know. I, I'm still hot too. I know. Don't allow me to cross I this gate too. I know. You are my <laughs> wife. <laughs> hey! Uh -huh. I am so happy. I was just thinking about her daughter. I said, this is already four years, four years in her marriage. Hmm. And God has blessed them with a beautiful daughter. Yeah, just that um, we are still waiting for another one to follow. Uh -uh. Nah, that one will happen. It will definitely happen now. But for now, hmm. let's continue to pray. Thank God for peace and harmony in their home. Do we really have any other thing to do right now but to pray for them? Oh. Uh, but I want you to ask her. Why the delay? You're supposed to have another one by now. Nanye, Nanye, relax. Eh? Ah, now nah, bad speed is too much. Oh, you can break. Jay break. Eh? <laughs> See, the, the most important thing is that they're living in peace. Eh? Look, babies will come. As many as they want. Grace will have siblings. Um, I still insist. You see, I want to know the number of grandchildren I have. Hmm. Besides, they don't have a man yet. Hmm. So we need we need more. We need more. Nah. I see the hot. Yeah, nah, yeah. I'm, I'm telling you to calm down. Look, I think you're hungry. Because I've actually made food for you. How many years? You've known me for years. Mm -hmm. And so you know I'm hungry. I, I know the way you sound. You're so hungry. easy food ready. Let's now. go and eat. <laughs> so that we know. <laughs> okay. 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 Look who is here! Grace, come, come on, on look who is here! Oh my god! Franco! <laughs> Franco! So tell me, how was your holiday in the UK? Oh, it was fantastic. I made sure my family enjoyed themselves, right? Of course we did enjoy ourselves. Girl, <laughs> yeah, you missed. Oh. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, we're going to go on our own trip and you'll be left out. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Mm. By the way, who, who made this? This is absolutely delicious. Did you make this yourself? I made it, of course. Thank you. Oh, wow. <laughs> Even Dauphina, you helped. But she was more concerned about eating my chicken. <laughs> I know. <laughs> 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 no, Don't worry. Your days in the kitchen will end very soon because I'm guessing a professional chef. Hallelujah. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Why? What, is this? what would she be doing? I'll be busy twerking and whining. You know, you know. I want my wife to be fresh. Oh my God, okay, okay, okay. She needs a chef. Mm -hmm. 
Mm-hmm. 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 Um, Frank? Mm-hmm. You're not serious, right? Oh, sure. Okay. Mm-hmm. You better not think about it. <laughs> <laughs> you better not. Just get it off your mind. Why? We're not getting a shot. We're not getting a shot. That's fine. <laughs> no, 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 no. Actually, my wife makes the most delicious meal in the world. Oh, They're just trying to patronize our God. <laughs> Please come. This is your salary for this month. Okay, sir. I increased it by 20,000 naira. Ah, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. It's all right. Thank you. It's all right. This is Grace. Thank you, Daddy, for me. It's yeah. all right. I'm open the gate. We're late for service already. Ah, yeah, quickly, sir. Right. Honey. Ready? You're yes, delayed. Come on, let's go. Yes, Want to spend the whole day? No. This mm-hmm. is very sweet, mm-hmm. very delicious. <laughs> but guess what? What? It's not half as sweet as you. <laughs> stop, Joe, stop being funny. Come here. <laughs> I mean, I'm still cooking in the kitchen. I'm not done. Hold on, I need to stretch up my muscles a little bit. Come here, come here. Don't move. Hmm? Mm-hmm. So you, <laughs> you know what? What? We need to go and cook something in the bedroom. <laughs> oh, please! No worry. Honey, you have something on the fire. No worry. That one can wait. Come here. That's the way, bro. My sweetheart, look, look, listen to me. You are the best wife in the world. I'm saying this because I know that, look, all the men on earth right now, their wives and tea, they don't even do half of what you do for me, for their husbands. Sweetheart, I am telling you the truth. You are everything for me. Yes. Okay, let me tell you something. Do you know the prayers that you said for me this morning before I left the house has already started manifesting? I am telling you the fact. Yes, and just to show you how much I appreciate you, I'm going to send you three million naira after this call. <laughs> Calm down. I know. <laughs> yes, you're a darling, my wife. You are a blessing. Like, look, no, tell, calm down. Let me tell you how you're going to spend this money. One million naira is just for shopping, okay? And the other one million naira, Use it to buy human hair. I want you to make your hair. Something very expensive. You know that uh, human hair, Brazilian hair you all talk about? Yes, look for a very expensive one and buy it. And the remaining one million naira is just for nothing. Just spend it on doing. Look, I know you're a very meticulous person, my sweetheart. So you don't, don't go and start saving my money. I did not ask you to save money, my sweetheart. Yes, my love. Okay, sweetheart. 
Uh, can I call you back, um, like, in the next five minutes, please? Okay, baby. I love you, too. Uh, Lizzie. Yes, oh, the file, huh? Yeah. Oh, it's ready? Good. Let me take a look. Um... And, um, meanwhile, okay. you're looking so dashing. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Lizzie. Thank you very much. All right, this is good now. Thank you. Okay. All right. From who? Yeah! The Lexite Marima! Correct! How far have you been? How long? You're ready? Yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm ready. Oh, just, just sit down. Just sit down. Just yes, make a right. Just side one. Franco! Yeah, correct, man. Just to make sure. I don't want to make sure that those wash do I make? I get no vex. No, 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 no. Gentlemen, you are the chef my husband recommended? Yes, ma'am. Please sit. Thank you. So tell me, what is your name? My name is Fred Obiora Okoye. What? Are you all right, ma'am? No! Yes. Um, never mind. You know what? I'll, I'll get back to you later. Please, Ma, I need this job so badly. I mean, I've been jobless for the past three years now. And uh, I can prepare any kind of African dish. Name it. Uh, Egusi soup, uh, Onogu, Oha soup, Uba. Uh, it's I, it's I okay. I'll get back to you, okay? That, 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 that's all I have to say for now. Are you alright, Ma? Gentlemen, I said I will get back to you. Okay? Please, ma, kindly consider me for this job. I mean, I am of a good conduct. And your husband recommended me for this job, ma. Please. I'll get back to you. All right? Sorry, ma. Here we go. Please, ma, I will be waiting for a positive call from you, ma. Please. What a shock! Yes, my love. What I am saying is that I do not need a chef, alright? I just realized it. I don't need one anymore. Sweetheart, on the contrary, we need a chef, okay? And a professional one at that. I've always wanted to hire him, but for some reason I lost interest. But now I see the need for it, okay? You would like him. Maybe it's just you and I and little Grace in this house. I can cook, all right? I am not complaining. Yes, my love, I know you can cook, all right? Listen to me, sweetheart. Don't get me wrong, I love your meals. And that's because I love you very much. So, I mean, whatever you make, sweetheart, I will, I will take it. Your meals are sumptuous. They are very tasty. But you know one thing? I do not want you going through the stress of that kitchen anymore. I want Fred to handle it. Okay? Let's not argue about this. We've talked about this before. And I thought we settled it. Okay? You don't have to bother about getting Grace from school. I'll get her. All right? I love you, sweetheart. I love you, darling. Later. Okay, your bag. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I never listen. Um, are you not going too serious about this unwanted chef? Fina, it's like you've not been listening to me. I heard you. Obira, Fred. 
Isn't it too strange a coincidence? <laughs> Come on, Ami. Anyone can bear Fred Obiora. Not just my late twin brother. Mm -mm. The sound of that name. Putting this fear in my heart. It just doesn't make sense. It's, it's, it's very strange. <laughs> Millions of people out there bear Obiora, not just my late twin. Uh -uh. Obiora Fred Okoye. Fred. Like, why would one person bear the three names of my ex, your dead twin brother? Mm -mm. It's, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't sit well with me. It's, I get it. You? It's weird. Yes. It's weird, but it might just be a rare coincidence. That's it. I don't even want it, Jeffy. Yes. <laughs> Come on. It's not that serious. Hmm? Cheers. Drink and relax. Baby. If you don't want him, I want him to stay. I don't want him. I don't like him. Why must it be him anyway? Why mustn't it be him? If there's something wrong he has done, let me know. You can't just wake up and, and you say you don't want him any longer. What's the problem? Babe, I said I can cook. I know you can cook very well. But I thought it was high time that we got a chef here. And that was why we hired him. Look, I want him here and he's going to stay here, period. Okay. No problem. Hire him. It's not like you even listened to me in the first place. Allow me help this young man. Please. So now, Grace is running. Grace is running. Okay, so now let's spell running. R. R. U. U. Double N. Double N. I. I. N. N. G. G. Running. Grace is running. Oh, baby, come here. <laughs> Yes, my love. Uncle Fred is helping me do my assignment. Oh, wow, Uncle Fred is helping you do your assignment. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Uncle Fred. Welcome, ma. Thank you. <laughs> Please, should I serve your food now or after resting? What do you have? I prepared a spicy, delicious cowpea, your favorite. How do you know? Cowpea is my favorite. Most beautiful women from the eastern parts enjoy eating cowpea, especially garnished with rightful recipes. Mm. Well, in that case, you'll serve mine when I'm ready, all right? Okay, baby, go back to your work, all right? Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Just, just go ahead. Yeah. Huh? So, yes. Now let's go to jumping. I bring to you a special delicacy. 
specifically prepared to take you back to old days when you eat cow pee. But the difference is this is specifically made by professional chef Fred. Thanks, Chef Fred. Thank you, ma'am. You will be needing a glass of juice to appropriately enjoy this wonderful favorite, ma'am. Um, there will be no need for that. Just go. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you so much for the meal. Thank you, sir. Grace, say thank you to Uncle Fred. Thank you, Uncle Fred. Well, thank you, my darling Grace. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Oh, that reminds me. Grace um, has been telling me how helpful you've been concerning her assignment. Mm -hmm. I really want to appreciate you. I'm grateful. Thank you, sir. I'm honored. <laughs> thank you. I beg to take my leave, sir. Oh, please do. Ah, sweetheart. Yes, Father. That reminds me, I'll be leaving to Abuja. I'll be spending three days there. Please, I would like you to take care of the home front while I'm away. Of course. When are you leaving? Tomorrow, precisely. Okay, in that case, I have to get you prepared. Thank you. Of course. You're so helpful. Oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> oh. You okay? So, um, the seminar starts tomorrow, huh? Make sure you're all been doing very, very early. Yes, sir. And endeavor to come with all the files that we will be needing. Okay? Okay. Yes, sir. Okay. Um, is there any other thing? Um, I don't think so. But if there is, I'll let you know. Okay? okay. Thank you. You can return to your room. <laughs> Good night, sir. Good night. Hey baby, <laughs> how are you? <laughs> I hope you're good. Oh yes, I'm in the hotel room now, I've settled in. I just called to um, let you know that I'll be going to bed very soon. Have you had dinner? Okay. I miss you. <laughs> How is Grace? Oh, very good. He's gone to bed. Good. Okay, I'll speak to you in the morning, okay? I love you very much. I love you so much. All right, good night. Good night, my love. <laughs> you looked tensed, ma. Me? No, I'm fine. I made cat's fish pepper soup for you. It's spicy. 
I know you love it. Fred, do you want to choke me with food? I don't want you to miss your husband so much, so I'm always here to attend to all your needs. That's very kind of you. So, should I present it now? No, 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 maybe later. It's all right. Fred, wait. Um, about the way I spoke to you the other day, I'm very sorry about it. I wasn't in a very good frame of mind. It's all right, I understand. Thanks for your understanding. Excuse me now. Going on. What is wrong with me? Why can't I sleep? What's funny? You're missing your husband, right? <laughs> Fina, you shouldn't get the picture. <laughs> What is it then? Lately, I started get I started getting flashbacks of Obira. I started wanting him more than my husband. His presence was just around me. I could I could feel it. it got me uncomfortable. That's a bad feeling, Amara. I thought we were done talking about my dead twin brother. I know, but I don't know what came over me. I was so restless last night, I couldn't sleep. But thank God that his spirit has been chained. Else my body was already open for him to come in. God forbid. Amara, why don't we allow the dead rest in peace? Just opening up to you. Yeah. It's okay. It's almost six years. Please don't remind me. Don't remind me of my twin brother, please. I'm sorry. 
I'm so sorry. I, I didn't mean to open up old wounds. It was just how I am feeling. And I thought I could talk to you about it. It's an emotional swing, okay? Do not attach anything to it. <sighs> So, how is Grace? <laughs> Grace is fine. Good, 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 good. Do you want something to eat? Easy. How did you get in here? What is that like? Calling my boss? You startled me. I'm sorry if I do. He was supposed to come back yesterday. I've been calling him and he's not picking up. Perhaps something came up. I understand how you feel, ma'am. Are you married? Because I do not see any wedding ring on your finger. She broke my heart. Cut off with me abruptly and stopped making me happy. Sorry about that. It's alright. Your name. Your voice. And even your job reminds me so much of my first love. Really? Yes. So, did you leave him or he left you? He left me. He died. Oh, boy. I'm so sorry about that. You miss him? Yeah, I do. But life goes on. You know what's Fred? I need to be left alone. Go home, get your things, and come to me. What do you think about this? Your wish is my command. <laughs> I have waited for this beautiful moment 
long time ago. <laughs> You're so cute, sweetie. Thank you. And good in bed, too. <laughs> Her beauty is like a wine that catches the eyes and drunkens the hearts. You're under my spell, which is my beautiful body. <laughs> Let's go one more round. <laughs> Secretary, but she's not responding. This doesn't even make sense. I don't understand what is going on. What is going on? This doesn't make does it? Doesn't make sense. Please. Come, relax. Everything will be all right. I promise you. Okay. okay? Relax. Come. I'm but I am not okay. I am not all right. I am not all right. I know. But you need to put yourself together. It's okay. Come and sit down, please. He was supposed to be here yesterday. Now he is not picking my call. I don't understand anything. It doesn't even make sense. What is going on? Um, Tamara, please stay calm. Nothing is going to happen to Frank. Nothing. I promise you. Nothing will happen to you. Okay? <laughs> Please stay put. I thank you. It's okay. Relax. It's okay. Can you stop worrying yourself already, Amara Chupo? Look, nothing is going to happen to your husband. He will come back to you. Don't let it bother you. Yes, relax your mind. Frank will be back. You know, mom. Okay? Don't worry. Everything will be fine, oh? What is wrong? So, hold on, not back. Okay, Let's speak to your father. Yes, Adam. I, I told you not to worry yourself. Relax your mind. Yes, believe me. Nothing will happen to your husband. Yes, granted that his line is not going, but I believe he will come back today or tomorrow. Yes, and it, it, uh, yes, if he doesn't come, we will come to the house to know what's going on. Yes, just please him, okay? My regards to my granddaughter. All right, back to your mother. I mean, mom, it's all right. Don't worry, everything will be fine, oh? No? He will definitely come back. Oh, mom. Mm -hmm. One, take care of yourself and my grandchild, okay? All right. One, take care. Bye bye. Nine. I am so worried though. I am worried. Because this is so like Franklin. Nothing will happen to him. Nothing has happened to him. It's just that maybe he would have lost his phone or something. He would have lost his phone and he couldn't even find a way to reach his family for five days now. Come, I don't want to think along that line. Imagine the trauma that is going through now. Imagine the trauma. What do we do? Oh, 
home. I'll go to his office first thing tomorrow morning. Oh, report to the police. Don't you think it's necessary? Amara is restless. Yeah, I think we should do that. This is strange. Frank, I know, would not stay and not call his family. It's almost six days. He has not called, no text. Honey, please don't call me crazy, but I am scared. Frank is safe wherever he is. That's all I can say for now. Babe, if he doesn't come back this weekend, I will go and stay with my friend. Hmm. Well, we'll all just go there and stay there. Hmm? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, yeah. You're worried. Fred. My boss will be back. Please, relax, man. I know. Thanks for your concern. It's all right. Should I make something light for you? No. I'm fine. You need to rest your head. I mean, it's almost 3 a.m. now. Fred, why are you still awake? I was at the kitchen preparing some meal until I sensed your presence here. Okay. Good night, man. Good night. This world we live in love. We die in love. Everything else is just illusion. By the end, move on with your life. Hello, <laughs> baby girl. Guess what? <laughs> Guess now. Uh -uh. Hey. Okay, let me gist you since you don't know. Can you believe that? The almighty Frank, my boss, has finally fallen for me. <laughs> the cheap girl. <laughs> yes, so, hey, that's not all. Do you know that he now stays in my house? Yes, since we got back from the trip, he has refused to go back. <laughs> Yet he walks from my house, actually. Oh, God. You can't believe this. Yes. Do you know that he now behaves like a zombie? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I swear. Do you know right now we are talking about how to divorce his wife? <laughs> Very soon, he will be all mine. And mine alone. <laughs> yes, so I can't believe this. Yes, so I need like this. Don't worry.
worry. And when I get home, I will just do the rest. Mm. I know you like her, my boy. Bye. <laughs> course now. Oh my god. Baby. 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 Oh my god, babe. What happened to you? Where, where is your bag? I've been calling you. I was... and you're going out. What is going on? Do you know the trauma I've been through? What is going on? Don't ever stand in my way. What happened? Did you guys fight? Not at all. We didn't even argue. He came back without his bag. I went to him, but he acted strange. Next thing, he went in and started picking up his things. I tried to stop him, and he pushed me down. Frank, Frank pushed me down. I cannot understand. This is serious. Calm down. Babe, keep trying, okay? It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. you do this to your wife? What is wrong with you? Are you done? Mr. Marriage Counselor, are you done? How I choose to live my life is nobody's business. Okay. I'm old enough to make decisions for myself. Amara. is not a good woman. She is not meant to be my wife. And I will leave my 
my life the way I want it. I have been pretending to be a good husband all this while. But no, I will not do that any longer. And now you're making out with your, your secretary. I mean, how disgusting can you both be? If you don't love Amara, why did you marry her? Why did you have to bring her up to this level just to break her heart? Well, that's why I'm filing for a divorce. Oh, you heard me right. And I would not step my foot into that house until my lawyer meets with her. I feel like... I feel like punching you in the face right now. Go ahead. Go ahead, punch me. Punch me if it makes you feel very good. But what gives you the effrontery to come into my office and tell me what to do? What gives you that effrontery? You look me in the eye. You see, you would punch me in the face. I've had it all to hear with you. Alright? And I don't want to see your ugly, disgruntled face ever here again. really very busy with work. Well, he's going to come back soon, okay? Call him for me. How about I call him later, hmm? Uh, it's time for you to brush your teeth. It's bedtime, all right? Come, let's go and call daddy later. anybody all right oh <laughs> right now i just want you i love the sound of that i, I, know. <laughs> I want you right i make you really happy mm -hmm. all right <laughs> baby let's start it what about the car you promised to buy for me so that's why your tone changed Do you even take me for? Relax. I have this under control. The car is coming in next week. Ah, really? Yes. Oh, I love you. <laughs> I love you more. <laughs> You're such a sweet boy. <laughs> I can't wait to be your wife. Really? 
gereja. your wife why what did they do wrong Frank Don't divorce me, I beg you, I beg you, please. Amara, you're just talking nonsense. Frank, Frank. And I won't take it. You have to leave my house, please. Why? Hey, why? Frank, that's your mommy said you traveled. Frank, please. Frank, please, Frank, look at your daughter. Frank, please don't do this to me. Most of these doors, please beg you, please. Frank, Frank, please, you can you can oh, go, no, go. Just I mean. sign the papers. I am done talking here. Sorry. No, 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 no. no. What did I do wrong? What did I do? I just want my husband it's back. Okay. I want him back. It's okay. Don't worry. Everything will be fine, eh? We'll, we'll definitely do something about it. How could Frank treat me like this? Frank, I will deal so deal with him because I don't. How could he toy with my daughter's heart that, this way? I will deal with him. What? what? No, I mean, it's, it's, it's okay. Huh? Don't worry. No, don't tell me to take him. You mustn't tell me to take it because I'm going to deal with him. Come, you are going to give me his office address. Because I will march to his office to let him know that my daughter is a precious stone to me. No, I don't think that will be necessary. Can you imagine? Your husband will come back to you. Give everything for us. No, but I just want him it's back. It's okay. He will surely come back to you. You know, go. Don't worry. Everything I, I, will be fine. I'm so deep with him. I, I, I don't. I don't. I don't just want to speak much. This is not what I want in my life. I'm here for you. How did you get in here? You called me. No. I don't remember calling you. I see everything. I mean, you don't deserve to be treated like a nobody. Your tears hurt me so badly. The world is, the world is crumbling. What are you? I mean, who are you? How did you how did you get in here? This is this is my room, my private room for me and my husband. What are you doing here? 
I know I'm Chef Fred. I'm only showing you my compassion. The way you come in and go. Hugged him. How? I mean, why? What is happening? What is happening to me? It's just so confusing. Frank, 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 Frank. Why? Why? So we can pray for you. It is you and your wife that need prayers. You see your wife? You two need prayers because you go about meddling in people's affairs. Let her know that if she comes to my office to try what she did today, again, I might do what I would live to regret. And you will be a dead man that day. You just say get Chris, Abby. I go kill your Chris. You so. What is that, sir? What they worry you? I'm going to move my house. I said, get out of my house. Are you deaf? Okay. I said, get out. No problem. <gasps> what, 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 what? what kind of temptation is this? And he changed his numbers too. This is absolutely ridiculous. You know, I almost killed that girl at his office, but he saved her. I regret ever marrying Frank. I cast the day I said yes to him. Please don't say that. I promise you, everything will be alright. We are in this together, right? Well, I have signed the divorce papers. If any one of you come across him, to let him know. Amara, 
two people cannot be wrong at the same time. I have delivered my message. Frank, you know, honestly, I at this point I strongly believe that Frank has been hypnotized. <laughs> so I took the fight to his office and he relocated. This is really serious for me. Mama Grace is with Fina. For now, until the lawyers decide where she will be living or who she will be living with. Besides, I'm done with the marriage. Oh, Amara Chuku, please don't say that. Bingo. My mama, I have said it. So? And what about your husband? Ex husband, Papa. Ah. Uh -uh. Okay. Has your husband been found? I don't care where he is. I don't even care if he's ever found. We are done. <laughs> and please, Papa, Mama, we have to return the bride price as soon as possible. Excuse me. Amara Chuku. Amara Chuku. Hey! Is this a dream? Is this really happening to us or is it a dream? Please, somebody, somebody wake me up. Wake me up from this dream. Oh, wake me up from this dream. Oh, what will people say about us? This is not happening. This is not happening. Nanya, calm down now. I see you'll be around your eyes. Everything about you reminds me of him. Tell me you are not Obiora. Prove to me that you are not Obiora. I think you're grieving. I mean, we shouldn't be doing this. I'm sorry, Ma. Does it mean you are taking advantage of my failed marriage? I'm sorry if I do. Maybe I should just end my servitude here and move on. No! No, please. But I'm not Obiora. I don't know what you're talking about. I want to be with you forever. You, you, why, don't, why do you want to cry? Um, I'm so sorry for everything that's been happening to you. I've longed for this. Excuse me. Um, I... No. Any other thing?
Amara, you cannot be like this with your chef. It's my life. Have you made out with him? Not yet. But as soon as he signs the divorce paper and gives it to his lawyer, then I'm a free woman. God forbid. God forbid what? Huh? huh? Did you see him? He reminds me of Obira. The way he does his things. It's exactly the same way Obira does his things when he was alive. You don't get it. Your friend is in shackles. And I'm loving it. Amara, I say it again and again. God forbid. What are you even saying? He's not my brother. Well, did you look at him? Did you hear his voice? No, no, look at me. Swear to me that it didn't remind you of Obira at any point in time. Amara, he is not my brother. Please, put yourself together. Stop being obsessed over a dead man. He's dead and gone. Okay. You know what? I don't even know why I told you in the first place. Excuse me. Amara. Amara. There is something weird about that chef. You need to have seen the goosebumps on my body. It was so strong. This is so strange. Babe, this, this, the, the, the chef is strange. He's... Uh, are you for real? Yes. Well, Frank and I have known him for a while now. Baby. Everything is happening all of a sudden. Amara is nursing feelings for him and it's not right, it's not good. Well, at this point, I I don't know what to say anymore. But I strongly believe that Amara could not possibly have anything to do with her chef. I mean, that's 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 unimaginable. Her chef. I'm going to ask her to fire him. You know what? Scrap that. I am going to fire him. Yes, because that... I tell you, that, that, that guy is, is weird. That chef is... He's... He's... he's I have this... Babe, have you thought about it this way? What if she finds peace? She's obsessed. And there is no peace there. No peace at all. You think? I know. Your friend went out. Would you want to wait until she returns? 
Are you by any chance trying to take advantage of her condition? Because it will not work out for you. So, you're here to tell her to fire me, right? And how do you know about that? Yes, I said it. You said I'm strange. We both know you are more than a chef. And I will not allow you hurt my friend. You should be more concerned about the baby in your womb. You're hiding it from your husband. It's a surprise, right? You wish your brother was alive. And your friend has found peace. Do not meddle in this else. You regret it. I suppose you have it in the house, right? I'll come and get it very soon. Please, I don't want you to waste any more time. Oh no, sweetheart, I won't, I won't waste time. <laughs> Let's go. Forever love you. Rubin, you are dead. I know. I'm just living like a prisoner of love. I can't touch you. I made it so. I love you so much. I cannot go by a day without thinking about you, our love, and how we used to be. I love you so much. Mama! Amara Chuku, who are you talking with? Me? Nobody, I'm, I'm just alone. You are talking with Tobiora, isn't it?
Amarachuku. Amarachuku, you are not sleepy, you are restless. What is the matter? Are, are you are you still seeing the pure in your dreams? Yes, about Obiora. He is gone and gone for good. Well, what did you say about getting married? I am not getting married. What, what are you? Wait. Oh, because of that man that came. Mama, I am not thinking about that man. I am not even considering it at all. Please. I don't want to get married. Anarachuku. I think you are being possessed by Obiora's spirit. Yes. You enjoy his company. Amara Chuko. You need to get married and shift all this love and everything you feel for Biora to your husband. Look, I know and I understand you loved each other. But you need to try and get him off your mind. Please. Please. I am not ready for marriage. I'm not interested. At least for now. What do you mean by for now? Huh? It's been years, Amaraju. It's been years old Obiora left. Huh? And this young man has been all over you, begging, waiting and pushing just to get a common reply from you. What is your problem? Mama, I am not ready. That is my problem. I'm not interested, Mama, because it's too early. I'm not sure there's no communication between the living and the dead. Oh. Hi! I love this girl so much. I'm not even thinking of marrying another man. Amara, why would you say that? You want to pause your life because of a dead man. Tobira means the world to me. Same here. He was my twin. I do not want to marry. Simple. Amara, Obira would want you to get married. I'm telling you that for free. But I do not want to do anything that will hurt his feelings. You're not going to hurt his feelings. Please try. You know, Obira. Obira is the most important thing in my life. He matters the most. But he's dead. But even in death, I still enjoy his company. <laughs> you want me to get married? My twin sister is right. I want you to get married so you can live a normal life. So you can be happy. No. I don't want to lose you. I don't want to lose you again. I don't want to lose you too. But I feel it's the right thing to do. But you would still have my body. Yes. And you will always come to see me. Yes. I will always do everything to make you happy. I will always give you myself. Amara. Amara.
Amara. Amara. Sleep is this? Sorry, I've been trying to, to get you for the past five minutes. You won't wake up. I'm sorry, Papa. Sorry. Now, go and buy me shaving stick. Okay, sir. And your mother hasn't come back? Uh, no, sir. Now go and buy me shaving stick. Okay. I hope she is not. He's about to do something funny. This is the divorce letter from Mr. Frank Chimezi requesting that this union be dissolved. Marissa, we already know that. Can you get to the point? I will deal with you. Because before you, 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 you... Old man, please shut up your mouth. Shut up your mouth, please. I don't want to marry your daughter anymore. Is that, is that a crime? I don't want anymore. Would you force me? Huh? Is it a crime to be married to this, to this daughter of yours? What's going on? What's wrong with you? Frank, is it my father you are speaking to in that tone? If I speak to him in this manner, what would you do? You better respect yourself, else I will insult you! In my in my own house? Yes! Under this roof? Which roof? Okay. This one? I beg, let's do this. Let's your friend of a dead human being. Frank, enough! What is all this nonsense? Everyone, please stop! No! It is better to be a girlfriend to a dead man than stay married to this useless man. You should be ashamed of yourself. Just imagine your With daughter. A shameless man. See who you trained. Frank is okay now. What is it? I'm not a joke, please. It's okay. Oh, mom. Um, but thank God you're still alive. He didn't uh, at least kill you for me. Please, um, for the sake of witness, have Mr. and Mrs. Uh, Frank Chimese ready to dissolve the marriage? Oga, you are speaking too much grammar. Go ahead, I accept. Let us sign these papers. I accept and I agree. I accepted yeah, it a long time this. ago. I'm gonna be out of this one. You foul spirit from the pit of hell! I command you to lose your hope. I take hold of your power by the name of Jesus. How dare you? How dare you? You do not have any place anymore to hide. Neither do you have any empty body to go and fuel your evil. I command you because the Lord has exposed you by the name of 
Jesus Christ out of this place. I cast you out of him right now. Get out of him. No! 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 She, ah! she belongs to me! She belongs to me! She promised to love and care for me forever. She stopped giving me herself. Light and darkness nothing in common. You do not have any place anymore to hide. I command you by the name of Jesus to lose your grip. You lie. She belongs to me. I am not going anywhere. She is mine and mine forever. I know the spirit. And the spirit knows me. I command you. I bind you by the name of Jesus. Don't separate us. She is mine. She is mine. You will live by fire by force in the name of Jesus. Oh. Oh, live, live, live. You don't have anywhere anymore in your life to stay. No. Live in the name of Jesus. A casual by the name of Jesus Christ. By the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You're the man of spirit. You have not done the sacrifice. You promised a run to the gods. Why have you failed your promise? Why is one I, I forgot? I completely forgot. No. Woman, easily forget their promises. Immediately their problem is over. You will triple the promise for trying to play a smart one. On the gods. Why is one? Please don't do this to me, please. Don't. Where can I get. get, get, get the gods have spoken. Please. Please. Is there, is there another thing I can do? Please. Why is one? No. Forget about him. Look, it won't work. I've already consulted Mwani Miri from my place. Yes. Just two cocks and a male pigeon, and your problem is solved. Are you serious? I am dead serious. I am dead serious. How can, how can only you bring three fat rams at once? Ebe can come me. Where has it ever happened? Eh? Are you, are you, are you, are you, what, what are you doing with it? Look, if he does not accept one, then let him leave it. There are so many ways to kill a rattle. Um, are you, are you sure this year, why you will walk? I am so dead sure. Why Mary is tested and trusted. He has never failed, and he will not fail. Yes! I trust her any day, any time. Look. You don't make a promise you cannot keep. Especially when you are exchanging agreement with the devil. You're lucky your head is not a target. The spirit just came to possess her, just to destroy the family and the marriage. Boo, boo, yeah, yeah. Boo, boo, yeah, yeah. Okara, mo, okara, mo. Ala, aguanti, inti, aya, anu. Mane, be, di, sin, si, e, soli, e. I, ji, ji, nan, gwa, yon, dmodo, ne, so, zu, anani, yi. Obuonye, wasundi na diya mwa. Obiora. Obiora. I free your spirit. This very moment. Go. Go and accomplish your mission. For he that refuses to hear. We definitely hear the striking of the thunder. Go. <laughs> Up. 
able to. Yes, I'm here to see Madame. Madame? Yes. I know, I've seen Oga. And he said I should come and see Madame. Yes. For what is it? My name is Chef Fred. Oh, Chef. Maybe the cook. Have you? Yes. She does like. Alright. Thank you. You more. Are you okay? Is everything okay with you? Elizabeth, what are you doing in my house? Um, I don't. I was supposed to move into your house after the divorce. Divorce? What are you talking about? Come to my house for what? Are you normal? Are you mad or something? Are you confused? Do you know where you are? The wrong house. Obviously, you're in the wrong house. Forget that! Get out of the house now! Go! What's wrong with you? Come! Are you are you? Are you I think I said you talk about what's going on. I'll take care of this. Yeah? Are you dead? Are you still there? I I I ah. Please go out. No, 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 I'm so sorry. No, what? Are you normal? Please go, please go! That's say what? No, for what? Sorry, honestly, I don't know what's going on. I don't know what's happening. Please, Father, please. We have given up the hope. We will lift him higher. Jehovah, we will lift him higher. We have given up the truth. We will lift him higher. Jehovah, we will lift him higher. We have given up the truth. Go 